kids, welcome back. Today we're doing week 13 and day three. Our highlight verse is Joshua 23, six through eight. We'll go to the King James Version first. Be ye therefore very courageous to keep and do all that is written in the book of the law of Moses, that ye turn not aside therefrom to the right hand or to the left, that ye come not among these nations, these that remain among you, neither make mention of the name of their gods, nor cause to swear by them, neither serve them, nor bow yourselves unto them, but cleave unto the Lord your God, as ye have done unto this day. Joshua 23, 6 through 8, the NIRV version. Be very strong. Be careful to obey everything written in the book of the law of Moses. Don't turn away from it to the right or to the left. Don't have anything to do with the nations that remain among you. Don't use the names of their gods for any reason at all. Don't give your word and make promises in their names. You must not serve them. You must not bow down to them. You must remain true to the Lord your God, just as you have done until now. This is the word of the Lord. Let us give him thanks and praise. Amen. Great job. Wow, I hear a lot of we must obeys in there, don't you? Okay, let's see what our explanation says. A long time passed and Joshua grew old. He gathered all the Israelites together and spoke to them one final time before he died. Joshua reminded them of everything God had done for them, how God had fought for them and led them to the promised land and that God kept his promises. Joshua reminded the people to obey the laws God had given to Moses. He urged them to remain faithful and to always follow God. So Joshua was about to die and he is talking to the Israelites for the final time. And he's letting them know, look what all God has done. Remember, God has delivered you from the Egyptians he brought you to the promised land, and he has won battles for you. He's given you all that you need. And so it's important to remain faithful and always follow God. Let's read the apply section. Joshua reminded the Israelites to love God and be faithful to him. We show our love and faithfulness to God by serving worshiping and obeying him fill in the blanks to reveal this week's memory verse you can copy it if you do not have a book you can write it down or you can just write it in your journals and um, i would love for you to take some time listening to the memory verse again okay listen to it a couple more times and try to get it into your heart because it's the these memory verses these are the word of God. And when we get more and more into our heart, then it helps us when we need those verses in our daily life. They'll come up to our memory and we'll be able to be strong and courageous and we'll be able to remember all that God has done for us. Okay, let's respond in prayer. God, thank you for always keeping your promises. Please help me to serve, worship, and obey you. In Jesus' holy name, amen. Now it's time for our memory verse. Joshua 24, 14, King James Version. Now therefore, fear the Lord and serve him in sincerity and in truth, and put away the gods which your fathers served on the other side of the flood and in Egypt, and serve ye the Lord. Now we'll look at 
the NIRV version. Joshua 24, 14. So have respect for the Lord. Serve him. Be completely faithful to him. Throw away the gods your people worshipped east of the Euphrates River and in Egypt. Serve the Lord. This is the word of the Lord. Let us give him thanks and praise. Amen.